Hey, you guys. We're getting ready to talk some Dollar Tree trash. Yes, you guys. I have a bunch of it. So, let's get started. welcome back to another video if this is your first time here welcome to all things burn i appreciate you clicking on this video and checking this channel out if you are a current subscriber thank you so much for coming back by and checking out this video you guys i hope you guys are doing well i hope your families are doing well and i hope you're living your best blessed life you guys you guys, I have a Dollar Tree empties for you guys today. I have a lot of trash, you guys, from the Dollar Tree. So I don't just be buying this stuff. I use this stuff that I buy, you guys. Um, I hope you're, today's Saturday. I hope your day is going well. You probably won't see this until Tuesday because I have another Dollar Tree haul to put up before I upload this one. So, yeah, you guys, it is gorgeous here today. It's like... 78 degrees it feels like it's 80 this is why i live in florida besides the um hurricanes and the lightning this is the perfect place to live so you guys let's get started on this dollar tree empties i have my little basket right here to throw everything in so i can toss it in the garbage when i'm done let me start with this this old orchard uh healthy balance white grape strawberry um, it has three carbs, two grams of sugar, and only 10 calories, you guys. So this was pretty good, especially if you're trying to watch your sugar and stuff like that. And you could take a screenshot of that right there if you would like. But yeah, you guys, the Old Orchard uh, Healthy Balanced drinks are pretty good. But I will have to say this one thing. Don't drink them warm. Drink them cold, of course. They taste better when they're cold, to me, anyway. Um, my old trusted Reynolds Wrap pop-up foil sheets, 25 to a box. So I love picking this up at the Dollar Tree. So I got that. Um, Hubby had put some steaks on the grill. And this is the garlic bread that we use to put on the grill. It's Geo's uh, Texas Toast, garlic toast. I always get this from the Dollar Tree, you guys. So, yes, I love buying that. I'm trying to figure out what's rattling in here, you guys. <laughs> um, I got some uh, Kendall Farm chicken broth, two of those, because when my mom was here and she got sick, I made some Zupa Toscana soup. And... Yeah, it was delicious, you guys. It was delicious. So, yeah, I might pop up a picture and show you guys. Um, it wasn't all the way done, but I popped the picture as I added the broccoli, not the broccoli, the kale in and was stirring it. Yeah, so I always use this in my Zupa Toscana soup. If you have not seen that video yet, I will link it in the description box below in case you're new here. So, definitely, you guys, definitely definitely are you guys getting ready for the holidays oh my gosh i was outside yesterday doing some shopping grocery shopping mainly and then some christmas shopping as well boy when i tell you those stores are packed those stores are packed and then with me just getting over covid i was like let me hurry up and get out the store because i don't want to catch covid again so but you guys, I tested negative on Thursday, you guys. So I'm negative. My daughter's negative. My mom is doing much better. So thank you guys for your prayers. I feel amazing. So thank God. Just thank God. But um, I picked up these two golden crust Jamaican style mild beef patties for my son. And um. We do it the old school way. Well, not the old school way, the New York way. 
where you slice it open after it's done and you put a slice of cheese in there. Oh my God, amazing. But I'm the only one who doesn't eat it like that. I used to eat it like that a lot when I lived in New York. But once I moved down here, I just don't put cheese in mine anymore, you guys. But my husband and my son, they love putting cheese in theirs. But this is at the Dollar Tree. They have the spicy and they have the mild. I get the spicy ones from Costco and you get a bunch of them in there. I forgot how many you get in that box. I want to say 12 or 16, but my son doesn't like spicy. So that's why whenever we're going to have beef patties, I'll pick him up the, uh, the mild ones. So, yep, those are good, you guys. This was that um, shower headband, but actually I used it to do makeup and stuff. It was the leopard one. Um, I got it in leopard pink, hot pink, and baby pink, and then leopard, yeah. So I might pop up a picture here so you guys can know what I'm talking about. But I hauled it a few Dollar Trees ago. Um, this is the uh, one-piece hair bonnet, the orange one. It works well, you guys. I liked it. It, was, it works well. Okay, let me grab some more stuff, you guys. Because I got a lot of stuff, y'all. A lot of stuff. So, I just finished using the Yardley Deep Cleansing Facial Towelettes. Y'all, this is a awesome, awesome product. Oh, I've been looking every single Dollar Tree I go in. I go and look for these, but I cannot find them. So, oh, I hope they get them back again because this is really, 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 really good. And you get 25 of them in here. They work well. They work better than the blue retinal ones that I use, better than the ponds. I know, better than the ponds. That was really good. Um, this is the Armor, not the Armor, the Arm and Hammer uh, Talc Free Body Power. I love this stuff, you guys. So I just finished it and I already bought two more. Which y'all will see in an upcoming Dollar Tree haul. Uh, let's see. Y'all, when I say I got a lot of stuff in here, I got a lot of stuff in here. These are just my uh, Hershey's Mr. Good Bar and the Hershey Kisses that I put in my little candy um, uh, dish that I have over there by where I record most of my videos. This was good. The Sweet Chaos Drizzle Popcorn Ice Gingerbread. This was good, you guys, but you have to like ginger and you have to like gingerbread. Because if you don't, you're not going to like it. Because the ginger is very strong. But it was good to me, you guys. I enjoyed it. Of course, these Hers Fire Roasted Sweet Corn Popcorn. Amazing. If you have never tried this in the Dollar Tree yet, you guys, try it out. You will love it. If you like popcorn. Um, Just... My husband just got through using the uh, Sunny Farm mixed fruit peaches and then the mixed fruit. So these are the peaches, you guys. And then this was the mixed fruit. This was the mixed fruit one. So, yeah. And I have two more boxes of the Kindle. Um, chicken, chicken broth because I made Zupa Toscana when my mom was here and then I made it this past Thursday so yeah so I love this stuff you guys I love that stuff um, just got through using the Hunt's Ketchup name brand always get that from the Dollar Tree at 125 yes please because the groceries are going up way too much way too much you guys way too much Okay, just got through using all of my Superberry Power Blast. I have one, two, three, four, five. So I drank all five of these, you guys. So I love that stuff, you guys. Sorry for the noise. I love that stuff. Also, my Ocean Spray Cran Watermelon. Love it, love it, love it. Name brand. I love that stuff. Oh, I love that stuff. Okay. 
ahead and put that over there. I thought I'd put that over there. You guys, if you guys have not tried Mrs. Fields, now you already know Mrs. Fields cookies are the bomb.com, especially if you're in a mall or like a shopping plaza and they have Mrs. Fields cookies and you go and get them fresh. Woo! But the Dollar Tree, the Dollar Tree has uh, Mrs. Fields chocolate chip cookies in the uh, freezer section. It has six big cookies right there, you guys. Oh, when I tell you these cookies are amazing and I put walnuts on mine. Oh my gosh. And they have it in rainbow, which has like, I don't know if those are M&Ms on that or... I'm not sure, but it's rainbow. And now they have the sugar cookies. I can't wait to try those. I just bought those, and I can't wait to try those, you guys. So, yeah. These uh, chocolate chips I used in my hot bar. Um, I did a collaboration with a few ladies on YouTube, you guys. And these were the chocolate chips that I used for the hot cocoa bar, hot coffee bar. Mine was mainly coffee, though, because I don't really drink hot chocolate like that. But yeah, these are the chocolate chips that I use for that. Um, these were the uh, a melt away chocolate uh, treat, which was the chocolate mixing spoons. You guys, I know if you've been in the Dollar Tree lately, you have definitely seen these chocolate spoons, you guys. So I also used that on my hot bar. You guys um, just finished using both of these tissues you guys um, this is the two ply big value that I always get from the Dollar Tree um, it has a hundred and seventy five sheets and it's a two ply and I seem to always pick up this pattern because I just love it and I just finished using the Scotties which I, I wish they would get some more of these because you get two hundred sheets in here you guys which is 50 percent more so just finished using up those love that fall pattern on there you guys because for covid between me and my mom those tissues were getting gone y'all um this was the uh swiss miss marshmallow hot cocoa uh packages that I use for my hot chocolate. Doesn't that look so good? Looking at this picture right here makes me want to make some hot chocolate. So I don't know. I may. And then I'm looking at this. Um, that looks like a graham cracker dipped in chocolate, you guys. What do you guys think? That looks like a graham cracker dipped in chocolate. But let me just go right here right quick because I have... um. Hold on one hold on one second, you guys. Let me go out this frame for a second. I have these sitting right here on my table, y'all. And as soon as I showed this right here in the back, it made me think of these cookies that I just hauled. Look at those, y'all. These are from the Dollar Tree. So I could make hot chocolate, stick one of these cookies in there. By the way, these cookies are the bomb. I don't know if I have the, the ones that I've already eaten in here. But you guys, whoo! If y'all see these in Dollar Tree, I'm sure they won't last. I'm sure they won't last, you guys. These are delicious. Like I was telling you in my Dollar Tree haul, when I haul them, they taste like the, I think it's the Milo cookies from, or Milano, or something like that, from Intamins. Woo, so looking at that made me, looking at that made me think of these cookies right here. And I was like, oh, wow. Interesting. Look at that, y'all. So I may have to try that. I may have to try that, y'all. So these uh, were the king cakes. One was the cake king and one was the brownie king. And I used these in my little yummy container that I got from Dollar Tree that was in the pet section. But because it was so cute and it looks like Ray Dunn, yeah, I bought it. So these were the, um, what's this, the cinnamon, cinnamon crumb cake bites, which are delicious if you've never tried them. Definitely try them hot. 
and these were the brownie ones that I filled up that container with. So these are really, really good, you guys. And they have the honey cornbread, which is amazing. So, yeah. Um, just got through using my roasted garlic mashed potatoes with that steak my husband made the other day. So that was that first picture I popped up and showed you guys. I don't know if the garlic bread was on there or not, though, but yeah. Um, this is the Suavitel. I like using this as well. Um, whenever I can't find the gain, I always pick up the Suavitel because Suavitel smells really good. Let me see. Oh, yes, Lord. It smells so good. So good. Um, I have another chocolate chocolate chip cookies because I made some of these when my mom was here. She was like, oh, those are good. So, yeah, I, had, I just got through two of those, you guys. This is the Intamin's Hot Chocolate uh, K-Cups. Interesting. I've never tried these yet, you guys, but I used them on my bar. I haven't tried them yet. I think my son did, and he said they were really good, so... If you see them, you guys, pick them up. I only have a few more things, you guys. A few more things. That's garbage. Um, this is the Mega Cushion Wet n Wow Pink Lippy, you guys. Let me see. Which is really, really nice. That was the top of it. I have worn this in some of my, let me see, it's kind of. It's not really showing up too well. So let me see. Is it going to focus? No, let me see. Let me see if it's going to focus. There we go. So, yeah, you guys, that color is so pretty, but I don't have any more left. But I don't even know who it's. Oh, Wet n Wild. Okay. So it's by Wet n Wild. If you see this in Dollar Tree, this is really, really good. And it is, what is it? What is the color? Um, does it have a color? Nope, I don't see a color. Oh, so the color is Doll So Hard. Doll So Hard. If you can see that. Doll, Doll So Hard with the number right there. So, love that. And of course, you guys, my gain. What would my Dollar Tree empties be without some game, right? I keep telling you guys that. <laughs> oh, my goodness. And then uh, we got through some, what is this? 150 uh, napkins, like dinner napkins. You get 150 count. Love picking that up from the Dollar Tree. Also, you guys, um, my pain patch relief patches, they work amazing i'm still using them yes because ooh, every now and then yo this bag be oh, i don't know what it be i don't even know what to call it but those things work they work really well so if you have back pain neck pain shoulder pain try them you guys they work pretty well they work pretty well and i got this b or i think that's how you pronounce it b or Love your pores. It's a rose quartz and charcoal um, daily purifying cleanser. It's really, really tiny, but I love this stuff. It works really, really well, you guys. Let me see if I can get the camera to focus. Okay. So, yeah, I really, really, really like that product. It was really, really good. And I think a lot. Is that the last thing? Yep. Okay. Just making sure, you guys, um, are these hauls relief? Cough drops that I got from the Dollar Tree. Me and my mom was going through them like crazy, you guys. Because that COVID was, whew, no joke. Just coughing like crazy, 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 crazy. So I think that is it, you guys. I'm just trying to make sure that I showed you guys everything. Yep, that is it. Let me get something to drink, you guys. I'm drinking water today. Because I definitely need to drink some water. You guys, I don't know if you hear the TV in the background, but I have Home Alone playing. One of my favorite movies during Christmas time. Actually, I can watch it anytime, but I just love Home Alone, especially the first one. 
It is so, so good. But I am about to do my hair. What else I got to do today? We're going to put the Christmas tree up today. I was going to go get my nails done today, but I'm not sure if I'm going to have time to do that because it is already 321 and they close at 7. So, yeah. I don't know if I'm going to have time to do it today or I'll do it tomorrow. But you guys, enjoy your weekend. Enjoy your morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is that you're watching this video. I just appreciate you guys so much. Enjoy the holidays. Be careful while you're out there shopping. Mask up, you guys, because you're going to be around a lot of people right now out there shopping and stuff. So I would say mask up because COVID is definitely back on the rise and so is that flu. And I know so many people who have gotten the flu over the last couple of weeks and it is no joke. And I'm like, I got my flu shot, so I'm happy about that. But I, I, I did not get my fourth booster for um, COVID, but I am going to do that as well. But you guys, the flu that's going around right now, I'm like, could that actually be another variant of COVID? Because they're not really talking about it right now, but just be careful, you guys. Be careful. Like I said, continue to enjoy your morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is that you're watching this video. I appreciate you guys. If you have not yet subscribed, why don't you go ahead and subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you'll be notified every time I upload a new video, you guys. I would appreciate it. Please give this video a thumbs up. It helps my channel out a lot, you guys. And welcome to all of my new subscribers. Welcome, you guys. Thank you so much for subscribing. I appreciate you guys. So you guys, continue to enjoy your weekend or your week whenever you're watching this video. Go and be kind to someone, you guys. It's the Christmas season. But you should be kind to people every single day, but especially during the holidays because there's so many people who have lost loved ones and they're by themselves right now. So they can use a little bit of kindness right now. So go and be kind to someone. Continue to live your best blessed life. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, you guys. Love y'all.